Hey everybody, I'm Chef Jacoby Ponder. Um, I'm a U.S. Navy veteran. Um, I'm a local Monroean, I guess we could call it that. Um, and I'm a chef. So um, a little bit about me. My career started in the U.S. Navy, um, 10 years in the Navy, like I mentioned before. Uh, while I was in though, I had a great uh, tour, had an opportunity to cook for a lot of great people. After transitioning out of the military, I had the opportunity to go to culinary school um, to get my associates in culinary science. While I was there, um, I had a chance to go on Food Network. So that's when CHOP happened and uh, Cut Through a Kitchen happened and I uh, continued on my education to get a bachelor's in food service management. And then I began to teach. So I became a culinary instructor at a couple of different institutions and I'm a personal private chef for celebrities now here in Georgia. I have my own academy called Chefpreneur Academy, where I uh, teach anybody who wants to learn culinary, but mostly focusing on veterans who are transitioning out of the military, who used to be cooks in the military, and don't quite know how to uh, translate their skill set to the civilian sector. So, and outside of that, I do a lot of cooking classes in the Atlanta area. And I came through uh, Walter County School District from all the way from Head Start, all the way to primary, elementary, Carver Middle School. The new one, so we was the one that broke in the new campus. Um, and then they uh, went to what we call Monroe Area Comprehensive High School, tongue twister right now. Um, and I graduated in uh, 2000 from that area. So I've been in Walter County School System for the duration of my life. Wow, um, the impact that the schools had on my life, was, it, it was the teachers, man, it's the faculty and the staff. Um, it was, it was amazing coming back to see a lot of those teachers still teaching and still doing great things. We used to have a lot of um, things um, like an auto mechanic body shop and stuff like that, um, that, you know, as, as a teenager, you just kind of push it away. But as I got older, understanding that those opportunities that were presented to me in high school, um, man, I mean, the world difference, you know, it prepared you for college, it prepared you for life, prepared you for the world. I think now um, students have it even more better with technology, things that we didn't have back then, um, with the uh, learning online and just, just everything is at their fingertips when it comes to education and learning. So, you know, there's no disadvantages to it at all, but I, I think the school district has come a long way with technology and teaching people. Um, it's something that I wanna get back involved with as well as education. Education is my background. Um, so I think um, students being prepared at the high school level um, really is preparing for adulthood. The CTAE um, track, of course, uh, not only prepares people for college, but it gives you an alternative if you don't want to go to college. Preparing students to go into the workforce is um, one of those things we definitely need, um, whether it's vocational, whether it's technical, hands-on, um, engineers, we, we need those people in our in our world. So um, I think that that's a, that's a cool thing to get into. You know, maybe college is not for you. I didn't go to college at first. You know, I went to the military, um, which I definitely enjoyed it. Um, but that's something that Walton County offered through the ROTC program that kind of, you know, guided me along the way and got me to where I am today. So definitely take advantage of any program, whether it's college or VOTEC or technical, anything you put your hands on, um, definitely take advantage of it. Certifications are huge. They're important for me in my career field. Nursing or culinary certifications are huge in this area. So any kind of certification or a jump start you can get in life going through these school systems to get it, take advantage of it.